So before we make this pot, which is based on a cylinder, the first thing I want to do is I want to make a system where no matter where we draw our cactus, because remember it's a drawn on cactus, uh, the cylinder goes to the base or the uh, first end point of the curve. And then uh, we replace it with a pot. So uh, let's set up a cylinder that goes to the base of our curve. So recall, uh, we have a curve and all of this kind of creates a cactus. What I'm going to do is I'm going to add in a cylinder and we're going to reshape it later, you know, uh, to make it look more like a pot. Uh, we're going to start off with a cylinder, and what I want to do is I want to position it in the correct uh, place. To do that, what I'm going to do is I'm going to transform it by which vector, you know. Uh, it's going to be using a sample curve, which is going to let us use the group input, which is the curve that we start off with as a curve, and I'm sampling it at factor zero. In other words, at the very beginning, we're going to take the position and connect that in right there. So now it should be at the beginning of the curve. Uh, to actually see this, I'm going to join this with everything else that we have so far. So now we can uh, visualize. It's going to be a little hard to see because the cylinder is big. But you can almost see that it's kind of based at the beginning of this. Um, and now we just kinda, we're going to kind of have to just kind of reshape the thing. So I'm going to take the scale. You could either bring down the scale or actually probably makes more sense. Mm, let's bring down the scale. Let's do it like that. So I'm going to bring down the scale like this. Uh, we can also use a vector math to manipulate the incoming vector for the transform. And we can say move it down a little. Um, we can also mess with the radius and the depth and all this. But I think something like that should look pretty uh, good. So the way this works now is when we draw our curve and make sure you can either like modify the existing curve or you can delete it and draw a new curve. The cylinder is going to go to the base here. As you can see, no matter how complicated our uh, cactus becomes. Uh, so now the name of the game is actually turning this into a pot, uh, which we will do in the uh, next part. So let me just draw a basic uh, thing for our cactus. That looks good. There we go. Um, now let's make a pot.